A lot of people ask me how I use math in my job, and I think one of the easiest ways for me to explain it is to say something like, when you turn on the news in the evening, or when you're talking to your parents, or when you're even watching a commercial, and something is said to the degree of one in six people have a foodborne illness every year in the United States, or 50,000 people contract HIV or AIDS every year in the United States. When you hear those numbers, know that there are are epidemiologists as well as statisticians and even more specifically biostatisticians and those are people who do math specifically for science. We are all working together to create those numbers. A lot of times people think, oh, one in six or 50,000, that's just one single number or one single figure. But there's so much that goes into calculating that number behind the scenes. So as an epidemiologist and as someone who uses math, a lot of times we use what we call modeling, which is a specific way to be able to communicate a specific statistic. Um, it's very, very complex in a lot of situations, and so that's why so many scientific minds are needed to be able to put in lots of time to make sure that you as a public have the most accurate numbers as possible, and not only that those numbers are accurate, but that they're relatable, that you're able to understand them.